In the back of our church, in a little narthex area here, we have what's called intarsia, I believe is that exact term, but it's a piece of art that's created out of different types of wood. If this was uh, dedicated and given when we refurbished our sanctuary, our worship space. This particular one points us to the waters of baptism. At Emmanuel, we have a, a theology and understanding of God's work in baptism, even for the littlest ones in our congregation that babies might be brought to those waters. Little boys and girls might be brought to those waters that they might be moved into the family of God. For they too are ones for whom Jesus has died. Baptism begins a life of faith, but there's more to it in the sense that that faith needs to be nurtured. It needs to be taught so it can grow. That happens at home, it happens in worship, and it happens in Sunday school. This morning, I'd like to introduce to you an adult volunteer who years back worked with our, our senior high kids, did trips and, and activities with them, but more recently has worked with our two to four-year-olds in our Sunday school. And this morning, she's gonna share a, a need that we have, a need that you might be able to be a part of. So I invite you to listen as we welcome Joan Morgan. Thanks, Pastor. So anyone who's been shopping lately, has more likely than not seen this sign hanging in the windows of retail stores and all the fast food places. And we have one hanging here in Emmanuel as well. We are specifically hiring Sunday school staff and every member is qualified to participate. Here's the deal. If we're to have a Sunday school program here at Emmanuel, we need lay teachers to share the love of our Lord Jesus Christ with our young people. It's that simple. Now a lay teacher is somebody who is not a professionally trained church worker. And that's you and me. We have had men and women and high school age students do a great job teaching. And it's a very unique way to serve. What could be easier than reviewing and sharing the Bible stories that we learned as children with our children today? The stories haven't changed and the importance of getting this information and this love taught to our children is very important still. But you might ask, what are the benefits for you? Well, you get to know some of the church families. Preparation time becomes a time of personal Bible study and children learn that you don't have to be a pastor or a teacher to share the love of our Lord Jesus Christ. When children are in Bibles in Sunday school, their parents then have a chance to, to attend one of the many adult Bible classes that we have here at Emmanuel. And the Sunday school also becomes a mission field for our public school students. And it gives a chance for your students to bring a friend to hear about Jesus. Plus, sharing the love of our, our Lord Jesus Christ with our young people is truly a benefit in and of itself. But what's the process? Well, Emmanuel orders um, teaching material from CPH. The material it has worksheets and take-home sheets. And if you're young enough age students that you're teaching, you even get stickers. And that's a big deal. The lesson plans uh, come packaged per student for 13 weeks, so those have to be separated into packets, so you have a lesson for each student every for every Sunday. That usually takes maybe an hour and a half or so, every 13 weeks. Then on Sunday morning, after a big group sing, you all come together in your classroom, you simply share the story that you've prepared, sing a couple of songs, and you pray together. You're simply sharing your faith and love of God with our young people. And if you're not so comfortable teaching, perhaps you'll consider being a Sunday school superintendent. That's the person that, that orders those materials and separates it by classroom, kind of becomes a person for coordinating schedules. But all members are eligible. Christian parents, grandparents, single people, high school people, college age students, everyone is a candidate for this mission. Now, Mar and I had talked about maybe doing some workshops, if that's necessary, we could do that but it's really not an overwhelming task. Ask a friend to help you. Married couples are a great opportunity, spot, uh, would be a great candidates for this. And if enough people are recruited, you don't even have to commit to every single Sunday. So please prayerfully consider a role as part of our Sunday school staff. We even have sign-up sheets, they're bright yellow so you can't miss them. Or simply call the church office. If we're to have a Sunday school program here at Emmanuel, 
We need lay teachers to share the love of our Lord Jesus Christ with our young people. It's that simple. So thank you for your time and for your prayerful consideration, and God bless.